approach and identify yourself. Law-abiding citizens will not be harmed. False alarm standing down. Yourself. Law abiding citizens will not commence an attack on the user.
Pam needs you in her room. Confirmed. Agent Professor has arrived. I have a mission for you. Without increasing efficiency of synth traffic flow, Parts of entire organization being compromised. Increase daily. Solution. A new distribution center needs to be established. A distribution center? What's that? The railroad organization calls distribution centers safe houses. A place where synths are stored and then rerouted safely through the region known as the Commonwealth. Mission details commencing. Pacify the target location. Fortify position to protect current and future railroad assets. New distribution center will be codenamed Mercer Safe House. Good luck. Kill them to let me know mission specs before the dead drop? Just once? Neil is transmitting loads of information. At first glance, the atmosphere appears normal. But I'm going to dive deep into the day. I already lined up another place to stash one of my babies. If you got the time. Take Requests.
Collect. Come on. Shooting straight, rookie. Inside, you got it. Hey, come here. You think you could use this? Got it.
Well, if it wasn't waterfront before. Broken?
Vista is still dark. Location enclosed. Exercise extreme caution. Sure, I'd see you again. You managed to get what you need. Nah, I just went out for a little stroll. Thought I'd stop back and say hi. It's a good thing your survival and my humanity aren't at stake. Otherwise, I might be annoyed by your attitude. But fine. I shouldn't have doubted you'd come back. You did get rid of Kellogg after all. Not too much of a leap to take down a courser. How'd you manage to get it decoded? The railroad helped me. Oh god, those kooks. I would have expected they'd be too busy trying to liberate vending machines, or setting computer terminals free, or... Sorry. They just have something of a reputation. You're not the only one who's been busy. I did the best I could from memory and things I've overheard through the years. Came up with some schematics for you. Wasn't easy. These hands are ridiculous. Fine motor skills have gone to shit. Here's the simple explanation. You need to build a device that will hijack the signal the Institute uses to teleport coursers and send you instead. You know the craziest part of the design? That classical music station, that's the carrier signal for the relay. All the data's on harmonic frequencies. You've been hearing it all along. I want to be clear that this isn't my area of expertise. I was bioscience, not engineering or advanced systems or anything. Bioscience? Advanced systems? Divisions within the Institute. Specialized groups working on various projects. It'll make sense later. But if you can build this device and make use of that code, you should be able to override the signal from the Institute's relay. Can you? I mean, can you build it? You have people that can help. This is a lot for one person, even you. I got it covered. Good. Good. Because you've got to make it in there. For both our sakes. And don't you forget our agreement. I've helped you as best I can. If you make it in there, you find that serum. It's my only hope for ever being... normal. So you find it. Now go on. Take these and get to work. You do whatever it takes. Call on whoever you know to help you. Protect and serve.
crop's been growing pretty good lately. Just thinking how wonderful it would be to get out of this infernal rain. Need something? I need your help with these schematics. Oh yeah? What are they for? These are plans for building a signal interceptor. To get inside the Institute. The Institute? Why in the world would you want to mess around with them? They kidnapped my son. Damn. That's some bad business. Even for them. I'd like to help, but you know my situation. I've got to deal with the immediate problems first. I haven't forgotten that you need my help. Remind me as soon as you found out what that settlement needed from the Minutemen. <clears throat> I haven't forgotten about your problem, but my obligation to the Minutemen needs to come first. Dance? There's still a place for you in the Brotherhood, if you want it. I'd be honored to join. Then that settles it. Halen, Reese, it's time to welcome our newest recruit to the Brotherhood. He shows a lot of promise, and with the proper guidance, I think he has the potential of becoming one of the best. Thanks. I promise not to let you down. You don't have to prove anything else to me. Getting that transmitter was enough. So you decided to stay, huh? I expected you to take your payment and run. I got tired of wandering alone. Too bad. I was getting used to the thought of you leaving. Reese, that's enough. Like it or not, you're going to have to learn to work together. And you, you need to understand what it means to be a part of the Brotherhood. We're not soldiers of fortune. We're an army. And we've dedicated our lives to uphold a strict code of ethics. If you intend to stay within our ranks, you need to obey our tenets without question. Don't worry. I've spent time in the military. Perfect. Then there's no need to give you a long lecture. So I'll get right to the point. I only ask for two things from anyone under my command. Honesty and respect. You fall in line, you stay in line. I give you an order, and you follow it. It's as simple as that. There's one last order of business I wanted to get out of the way. I'm going to recommend you to be awarded the rank of Knight. Now, nothing's official until you speak to Elder Maxon, but I wanted you to be the first to know. Thank you. Thanks aren't necessary. Just continue excelling at your duties, soldier. Ad Victorium, Knight. He doesn't even know what that means, Halen. Ad Victorium means to victory. In our eyes, Defeat is unacceptable, because we're fighting for the future of mankind. Our rallying cry is more powerful than any weapon you could ever carry. Remember that. Now, I've received orders that we're both to report to the Pridwin. However, if you want to run a few ops for Scribe Halen or Knight Reese first, they could certainly use your assistance. I'll leave the choice up to you. Let me know when you're ready to mount up. Excuse me, Scribe Halen. Re still giving you the cold shoulder. I wish we can see eye to eye. Reese only sees one thing. Reese. Reese bleeds brotherhood. It's all he cares about. It's his family. It's his whole life. 
If anything else comes into the picture and gets in the way, he shoves it aside. Is there something between the two of you? When I first joined up, Reese is the one who sponsored me. He took me under his wing, showed me the ropes. I thought there was a little more between us, so... I asked him if he cared about me that way. He told me the Brotherhood of Steel was all that he cared about. And there was no room for anything else in his life. We never spoke about it again. Look, I... I need to get back to things. If you're worried about Reese, just keep doing what you're doing. He'll come around soon enough. So, are you ready to take on your first assignment? What exactly does the scribe do for the Brotherhood? We do everything that the pilots and the soldiers need to keep all of their operations running. All the scientific research, the repairs, the tactical planning, you name it. <laughs> we do all of the technical work. Of course, I'm a field scribe, so I'm boots on the ground with the soldiers, but I kind of like pulling the trigger every once in a while. Anyway, I won't bore you with any more of the details. You ready to head out on your assignment? Ready. Great. Let me explain what I need you to do. One of the Brotherhood's most important duties is the recovery and preservation of technology that was lost when the bombs fell. I have a list of locations that contain artifacts we need you to recover in order to have them cataloged and studied by our scribes. Here, this should cover all the information you'll need to find your first artifact. Good luck, and be careful. <laughs>